Hey guys, what's up? So do you want to improve your gameplay with the new Masha? Good news because I've got 10 tips to elevate your skills. Tip number 1. When collecting energy, it's sometimes better to stay at the last HP bar. At this state, you can spam your skills without losing HP. And you can also collect faster because hitting enemies with her skill 1 will give more energy. Tip number 2. Mash is a late bloomer. Avoid early brawls and focus on farming. Aim for 2 to 3 core items before getting aggressive. Trust me, the mid and late game power spike will be worth it. Tip number 3. The current meta favors a burst damage build for Masha. Her skills can scale well with attack items, allowing you to deal insane damage on both squishy and tanky enemies. Tip number 4. Masha's ultimate cooldown resets whenever you lose an HP bar. This lets you cast multiple ultimates for insane burst damage. Perfect for taking down priority targets in a snap. Tip number 5. The basic combo is this way. First skill, ultimate, two basic attacks, ultimate again, another ultimate, and finish with your second skill. Remember, the number of HP bars you have is equal to the number of ultimates you can cast. Tip number 6. The combination of Master Assassin and Sea Halberd is an effective way to increase her damage. That 7% damage increase on Master Assassin, while 8% on Sea Halberd. Tip number 7. If you're having problems aiming her ultimate, Hero Lock is an extremely effective tool in selecting specific targets for Masha. Just tap your icon before you attack to make sure you don't select other targets. Tip number 8. The new Masha is also a tank healer. At full build, she can deal 20% max HP damage on a single enhanced basic attack. Two hits and even the beefiest tanks will crumble. Tip number 9. Immortality gives you a chance to recover an HP bar after resurrecting. But you can only do this if you have enough energy. Just type the special skill consecutively while you are resurrecting. Tip number 10. Don't be afraid to fight enemies with crowd control skills because Masha's new passive is like a built-in purify spell. Whenever you lose an HP bar, crowd control effects are removed and you can even block one instance of damage. This gives you an assurance to complete your attacks or retreat if needed. So there you have it, 10 tips to improve your gameplay with the new Masha. So do you have any other tips to add? Share it in the comment section. That's all for this video. Stay safe and thank you for watching.